In this video we're going to add the MailChimp Facebook competition form that we created to our customized tab. So I'm going to presume that you've added a customized tab. In my case this one is called free videos, yours would be called competition and I have added the form here. So we presume with the previous video that you have the WooBox tab added to your Facebook page. So you log into MailChimp, you click on lists and we created a list in a previous video called Facebook competition. So then we look at the sign up forms we click on the general forms and we can see that this is the form that we built using a previous video. So what we need to do then is click on share it and to click on this link where it shows us the form as it would exist on the internet. Now one word of advice here is to use Google Chrome, the browser Google Chrome. I just find it easier to use for this particular example. So we're going to right click and view the page source. And we need to copy all of this code and put it into our customized tab. Otherwise the image that sits above the competition will not be seen. So to highlight all the code, we click on Control and A at the same time. We can click on Control and V for copy, or we can right click and click on Copy. And then we go over to our Customize tab, click on Settings. And it's important that we are in the Source as opposed to the Editor. And again, we're just going to click on A because your source code here should be empty. If it's not, clear it out. And then we're going to paste in the code that we copied for our form. We scroll down, we leave everything else here off for the time being. This will be covered in the next video. We call the tab name Competition and we save our settings. And if we go back to our website and click on the Customize tab, we can now see that the MailChimp customized form to enter the competition is set up on the Customize tab. Two additional tips that you can also do here under Settings. is to scroll down through the code and near the bottom you can take out this piece of code here that removes the MailChimp logo from the bottom of your competition entry form if you wish so we're going to delete that piece of code it's essential that that's all you delete so where it starts with power wrapper and ends with email marketing we're going to delete that out. The other thing that we should change instead of calling the button subscribe to list we're going to change it to enter competition. Again we can scroll down to the bottom click on save settings and we go back to our Facebook page click on our customized tab and we now have our competition entry form with no MailChimp logo at the bottom and enter competition is here so people can enter their email address enter their name choose the answer to the competition and click on enter. In the next video we look at the other settings 
and how to send out an email newsletter to these subscribers using MailChimp.